Why, hello there, everyone. Uh, apparently, though, the, um, so, yes, we are here with some fans, which actually is the reason I am recording this video today. Days like, uh, this, I do actually, I, I like when I'm in a server, and then people are like, wait, is that? <laughs> that makes me smile. So, I told them we would go tour their ships, and while we do that, I'm actually gonna do some talking. So, what's his name? Pool Pro? Alright, let's go see this pelican. So, um, anyway, um, I actually recorded a solar... Uh, pelican tutorial. Uh, just let me note that I, um, oh, this is cool. Um, just let me note that I didn't, uh, so let me just note that, uh, I, um, already made that pelican tutorial, except right now I'm having, uh, my friend Billy combine it for me. Um, and shout out to these guys. These guys are, uh, him. Yes, these guys are fans, and, you know, Whenever I see you guys in game, don't be afraid to say hi. I, it truly makes me smile when I encounter fans. So anyway, let's go on here. So yes, got some solar panels hybrid. Yes, I have. I you know I get what he's doing there. All right, so yeah, nice. Got multiple pools, radomes, funnel, carnival funnel. Oh, I gotta love the carnival funnel. I say they got a really nice funnel, like the carnival ships. Uh, nice. Uh, these is, could only um. Nah, it's okay, dude. You don't need a lot of solar panels. Um. Oh, he's talking about fairy lines. Yeah, that brings back memories. It'd be cool if we could put plants on our balconies. But anyway, um, so right now, uh, that I think they should, so I'm assuming these are all balcony rooms. Nice. Alright, uh, oh, big, thick bridge. I mean, this is like a freaking pelican right here, and look how massive this bridge is. Holy crap. The, yeah. You did a really good job making this uh, bridge if the, um, the creator of the ship is watching. Um, yeah, you did a really good job. I like how big it is. It's just like when I went in the Harmony of the Seas. Uh, generally, I don't do it that big, but, you know, it's pretty neat. Um, well, why don't we tour it using edit mode? So, uh, let's just go up here. Um, nice pools. All right, where did you did this deck? Oh, so that's what that was. Uh, oh, see, if you had batteries, you put some batteries right there, but, um, yes, got little chess boards, more rooms, yes, rooms are very essential plants, oh, that's nice, um, right, so let's go down, um, you could probably put, like, a room or something there, um, uh, this is just, like, my opinion, okay, so I get this, it's like, alright, throw the lifeboats overboard if our ship starts sinking, makes sense. See, he's got a decent amount of pools. Three pools. Bathroom. Alright, I get what's going on here. Alright, pretty nice ship, I would say. Oh, and he actually... Oh, well, let's actually go down to the engine room, because, like, I... I used to do that on my ships, except nowadays, I don't... I don't... You, you can't really see the engine room on my ships nowadays. Right, so let's just go all the way down here. Uh, does he have a separate staircase somewhere? To go down to the engine room? Oh, yeah, here we go. Alright, so he's got four engines. Oh no. Five, six, seven, eight. Wait, no. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Alright, ten engines. Um, what is the. Oh, that's the pool, I think. Right, so this guy's got a decent amount of fuel tanks, I would say. Um, right, so I like this guy's ship. So let's go on to the next ship. I'm just gonna hop onto all the ships while we are here. Alright, um. Okay, it's a raven. And actually, funny enough, he named it Nat Geo, but what's actually interesting is this class was called Nat Geo, which Haggy renamed it to uh, a raven. Alright. Uh, yes. Oh, I gotta give these guys a picture window, lol. Alright, let's go on down. Um, nice, you got our little... Um, yeah, see, I like when... If you set it up like this, it kind of looks like a buffet, I think. Um, I personally think, at least. Um, and this is, like, that kind of ship that I say goes perfect with, oh, he's not docked here, but this is that ship I would say, this class goes perfect with Iceberg, really, I mean, it, it just makes sense to have a ship like Raven over here. Um, oh, and Pelican. Uh, Albatross, me. We're well, not, like, seeing Harmony of the Seas, uh, that, uh, thing. Alright, plants, nice. Sure, wait, was I just on your ship, or was that... Yeah, I'll, I'll tour your ship. So, let me just, in the meantime, continue with this guy's ship. 
Right, so I think we've seen all the decks. Yeah, because this is the engine deck. Alright. MJ, you got a pretty neat ship. Uh, let's go... I'm assuming that's default. Can I take you for a fast trip? Yeah, oh, sure. Oh, yeah. Yeah, al being alpha is nice. I think he said it goes like 40 knots. So while we look at his ship... So, yes, I can see the all solar right here. Um, for sure. And I'm assuming that's a pelican. Oh, yeah, MJ has... Wait. Who's got a... Oh, that's that one pelican that I was touring. Alright. Um, you could probably put, like, railings here. I mean, just, like, I don't know. I mean, the NPCs wouldn't fall, but, you know. Oh, yeah, and on this ship, I commonly actually put a staircase here, except I'd move it over one. Alright. Um, nice. I like the marble. It kind of shows that, like, this ship is not cheap ship. Alright. Alright, so, what's up here? Rooms? Nice. Nice. Um, he could do fake balconies just to give the essential look, I guess. But this is just all my opinion or what I'd do. And I like that he... Uh, just please make it quick. Alright, because I got some other ships to do and I didn't want to make this necessarily as long just to upload on more of a wide the video that I was going to upload the tutorials. Uh, if I do believe it was like 50 minutes long, according to Billy or someone. Um, so, as when it gets combined, so right now it's kind of converting to a, con a combined version. So you guys will probably see it about 8, 9 p.m. Central Standard Time. Or 10, and you know, it just depends. Alright, uh... Yes, I'm on. Uh, yeah. You know, it's, I like coming to see your guys' designs. I mean, it makes, it's pretty neat to always come and see these type of things. I'll go just waiting for the acceleration right there. Alright, yep, so we're moving now. Um, are we in the engine deck or no? Alright, we're I'm like, because it's a little weird if you, I mean, I've seen people, I mean, credits, if you're not, if you're just like, oh, I just want to go like three knots anyway. Um, what's actually quick, oh, that's just all batteries anyway. Oh, you can put an engine. Oh, wait, what? Oh, he doesn't have any engines, I don't think. Oh, this guy's no engines. Well, te okay, technically you don't need it, but you can't really go that fast. Hoping I'm not going to lose connection here. <sighs> okay. I thought he said this was going to be a fast trip. Well, uh, no. Oh, wait, he's turning. Um, here's what I don't get, though. I mean, I get that the... I thought he would have had some engines on here. Um, right. Okay. Ooh, pelican! Hey, look, it's a pelican. XD, I like that. Um, I feel, I, I honestly, for one, if I could, honestly, I'd get, I'd give out cash for people to get a pelican or an osprey or something. Uh, cause there's some people out there like this that they, if they had like a bigger ship, they could do so much more. And then, uh, you see my beastly pelican. Then you see an albatross like him around the corner. You see my beastly albatross. Uh, yeah. Alright. <sighs> 15 knots? Wait a minute. How? Oh, wait. Or is it just the AZ pod motors? Huh, I didn't know you could go that fast. Because, like, I. If the sun was. Right. Oh, shoot. I keep jumping over the edge of this ship. Yeah. Uh, it would go back. Oh, yeah, because the this like does like one point. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I saw it. Oh, um, also, if you didn't know, uh, I may have announced this before. Um, they have a, uh, they're building, they're gonna build, they're not building, but at some point they're gonna build a ship that's between Pelican and, uh, between Pelican and Raven. Uh, I'm kind of wondering what type of bridge it's gonna be. Is it gonna be, like, an open concept like this in Cormorant, or is it actually gonna have, like, bridge wings? Like, if it was just one more deck taller and it had bridge wings, then... 
differently. Yeah. That wouldn't take long to build at all, really. Yeah, yeah, I'd do it. That would also allow me to do some more tutorials as well. Um, yeah, we're gonna do it, right? Alright, well, I wanted to go on a cruise, but I kind of want to go glance at these other Hurons. Um, no, oh, he's actually got a Huron gun. Um, okay. Yeah, uh, alright. Yeah, we're going back to this guy's ship, because... Yeah, so anyway. Jesus is actually going pretty decently speed. Uh, yeah, so, um. Right, so, hopefully. Um. Oh, oh, I'm just a little tired. I'm in school. Um, so, I'm hoping that, uh, the. Billy's almost got the video ready for me to upload. Actually, I could ask him right now. Asked him so anyway. Oh, yeah, so it's gonna take like 30 minutes to convert, then it's gonna take him like 20 minutes to upload to Google Drive, and then it's gonna take me like 20 minutes or 30 minutes to upload. Uh, dude, you're gonna crash. Oh, jeez, all right, <sighs> yeah, I go, jeez, man down, man down, in sector C. All right, dude, come on, yeah, you know, I could usually. I can usually beast around this corner without, like, crashing. So what I'll do... Oh, there's my Osprey over there. My default Osprey. Oh, jeez. So commonly what I'll do is, um... I'll come flying around that thing, um, like, up here, and then I'll throw it in reverse, and then strafe le uh, left, and that's pretty much... Um... Oh, dang it. You can't hop in the pier on Orion. Oh, yeah, you can. Alright. Yeah, this is a pretty neat ship for a raven. Dude, I just told you. I saw it in night mode. Um, but anyway. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright. Um, let's wrap up today's videos. And yes, I'm building a solar osprey. And, uh, yeah. Hope to see you all later.